right. Here we are. Episode three, baby. Let's go. Pine blind? Wait, what did I miss? I cheers you. Oh, I'm confused now. Oh, you're talking about the intro? i it's it's such a simple thing. It's ridiculous how simple that is, and yet how much time it's gonna save me in the long run. Yeah, yeah. Oh, for the black screen, yeah. So so the reason I had the black screen to start with is because I can't there's no way to put well, there's a way to do it, but I don't want it was easier to do it this way. Or this is the fix this way. The video starts immediately as you go to the scene that it's on in OBS for the uh, the intro or the bumper or whatever you or if you will. Um So I have to start on the black screen so I can hit record, then hit the button that transitions it, right? Otherwise, it gets w cut off, you know? So that just gives me enough reaction time to press a button. Which version of OBS? Uh, whatever the latest studio version is. And then, yeah, but the concept itself saves a lot of time. Like, I don't have to render a, an entire new video just to put a five-second bumper on the video, you know? It has less quality control, I guess. Like, I can't check the video to make sure everything's good to go anyway. But, like, that's... For where we're at in the YouTube production stage, that's fine. I'm just trying to get this crap... I don't say... I want to say crap, but, like, I'm just trying to get this stuff uploaded, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not... 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 Elements. Yep. I'll, I'm just curious as to what happens if I grow these all next to each other. I, I don't know what happens. I don't know if you can grow these next to each other. But I'm going to start doing that for um, Tarkov as well, which, again, saves so much time. It's wonderful. All right, we'll start building with that at some point. Okay, so. Um, smeltery. I think we're not going to mess with the... Um, let's see what we have first. I think we're going to not mess with... The village stuff until we can get that piggy backpack going, which is not too hard to get. I think. We'll see, though. Um. All right. <laughs> that made me do a double take. Look at this cow. This made me do a double take here. Look at this. <laughs> I think you mean her. Oh, it's the simple things. It's the simple things in life that really, uh, really amplify it. Oh, man. Nice. Thank you guys for the workout. Definitely do that. Is that a villager? Oh, no, it's a bee. Creeper bee. Nice. I want that cow. It's really good. The villager mask is pretty good, too. We need to find kind of more of everything here. Sand is easy, of course. Looks like I can get clay kind of there, too. It's just gravel I would like to find a big smacking of. Over here is probably not too bad. Let's go back to our base. It's on the way anyway. Um, I'm not sure why I headed towards the village. Oh, I missed some stuff in there, too. Nice. Uh, maybe we don't need more clay. We're gonna need a little bit, I guess. You just saw a creeper bee, yes. I think it I think it just gives you creeper like creeper drops. Alright. That's 16. I need 28 total. Let's just do 32 total for that. Just so we know how much we have left. I don't know if I could get this from the village, but it's just like right now, I think I'd rather just make my own. I think it's gonna be easier. Plus, it leaves the village intact. I know. Who am I? What have I done with that pine? We'll probably grab, still grab the tree to wood from there, though, I guess. Right. But, like, you can just do so much with two shulker boxes, you know? Alright, let's do 
let's just do that and uh, keep those rotating so i really just need sand and gravel and a little bit of clay so we could go here there's sand gravel and clay so let's just yeah let's just go do um do west or do east excuse me oh boy no pumpkin yet as long as not chunkling it should well they won't grow i guess too i should report that you're right i'll have to remind myself to do that after stream oh, so close I really do love the way those look. That looks so cool. It's like a natural swimming pool. Oh, there's that thing. Definitely should get this. Pew. Oh, so that can move. Oh, I never put that on, did I? I never. Oh, I did put that necklace on. Said so I should be able to move freely in water. Not really sure what that meant. Did not really live up to expectations, though. It's a, it's honestly, I've been having so much fun with it. Bond, it's really, it's really good. It's really, really good. But I, I keep in mind, I'm all. This is also exactly what I'm in the mood for right now. Is this style of pack? So. Like a village here. That's a really cool village. Look at this. Oh, that's so neat. I love it. We're not going to pull for beds this time. I know. I know you guys are excited for that. We are, however, going to look for that villager hat. I would love to get one of those. Hey, Justin. How you doing today? Oh. All is well. Oh, that's neat. Oh, it is a Batania. I thought it was a... Interesting. Or maybe that's just in a flower pool. Because they're considered flowers because of Batania. I don't know. Hard to say. Infinity Ham. Infinite food that restores 10 of hunger per use has three charges restoring every 30 seconds or every 60 seconds. Huh. OP. The funny thing is, the, the funny thing about that is, we're going to want to rotate our, um, we're going to want to rotate our food or, like, get nutrition going. Oh, there's an airship. That's good to know about. Oh, yeah. Nice. So, like, that's good for now. But it, um... Later on, we're going to want to make our own food. Exterminate. Exterminate. Oh, there's two of these guys. Nice. These chests seem like they're really good to get these. Yeah. Just whatever nonsense is in these. I'll take it, though. But yeah, for now, it's going to be great. For sure. Need the sonic screwdriver, my friend? I do. Yeah, we'll get the whole sleep. Arzueva, great mod, yeah. I've yet to actually... Yeah, I wouldn't want to be inside me either. Um, We're going to have to... Uh... Why is my brain not suddenly not working right now? I, I totally lost my train of thought. Oh, well. It happens. All right. Sand and gravel. Please. So 
this has the the boss in it. We're not quite ready to take that on. He's pretty scary, I think. We're gonna go this way. Yeah, his little boss bar popped up there for a second. Because now we have the mining level for this. I would like this gold block. Vitality's pretty good, I think. Mending. If we can get that off of there. Excellent. I mean, also just for, in general, um, we could use that sword. Like, you know, if we get some sharpness five on there, probably wouldn't be a bad sword to have. All good, Duba Windows. Doing pretty well. Thank God, no ore excavator. Feel free to add it if you feel like it would enhance your play, but none of that nonsense. Or not that I'm aware of anyway. It could be bound to a different key, and I'm honestly, I think I'm just gonna. If it's in there, don't tell me because I don't want to have this pack be ruined. <laughs> can't stand it. it it ruins a lot of packs for me like like what's the point of doing this tool with or excavator right what was the point of going mining redstone without that you know there was no point there is no point it, it just ruins like tool progression and the point of a hammer the point of a lumber axe the point of all that kind of stuff yeah, I don't hate it as a late game stuff that you strive for. I don't mind it then. Because you still need to do that early game stuff, right? But. Yeah, no, I'm just not a fan of it. Uh, Skyblocks are about where the only place I like it. I guess we'll keep the Acacia Sapling. a vein hammer now that's cool that's fine you gotta earn it you know and i and i may end up not liking it am i no i was gonna say i didn't think i was insta mining those just yet so i'm grabbing all this netherrack because we're gonna need it for um the tinker like the the smelter we had on plus soul sand uh-oh Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ow. I mean, I should have expected that, but ow. <laughs> they really don't have much health. They do have funny death animations. Those little buckers run for the hills, pretty much. Swiftest strength jump boost. I mean, strength is pretty darn good. So does resistance. I mean, you can only wear one, right? It'd be kind of cool if you could get all of them on one. Yeah. Get a little speed going here. Although we have the slime thing to bounce around with. I think I'm going to get resistance on. I think it's a tie between, like, going offensive with... Oh, I'm going the wrong way here tie between going offensive with um, strength and going defensive with resistance. Resistance is really powerful as well, especially when we have limited armor. <laughs> the infinity ham is just silly. Okay, that's just silly. I didn't realize it like grew itself back. That's so good. Good job. Good job, infinity ham.
Yeah, yeah, not those guys. The boss band is pretty dangerous, if I remember correctly. Hmm. I don't remember what pack you're talking about, Simon, but that sounds like a good, way, good place to have it in there. But, like, also, having good tools helps you take down buildings quickly, right? Having a good hammer and a good lumber axe does that. At least I think, anyway. Right. We just threw a trident at me? That's rude. Ow. Root. God. Mending, though. All right, worth. Absolutely worth. That was almost really bad for me. He did way more damage than I thought. Even with the res resistance mask on, he did way more than I thought. Oh, well. I mean, we only have leather armor on. That's the problem. I need to be over here. No, I need to be over here. Still really far away from that. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think we can make that jump. God, the infinity ham is too much. We are going to need some soul sand, which I do believe spawns in, like, the dungeons. Um, Iron Grajeel. We can eat Soul Sand plus Netherrack, I think. I think. So either way, it's good to be good resource to have. I don't know. I feel like it could be could be good, regardless. All right, let's just pick up our sand here. Oh, the mass didn't take damage back in 112. That's fair. Meteors as well. That makes sense. So it's the pa a pack that forces you to explore is great. I love that. Especially with the stark contrast of just having come off of a sky block. <laughs> you know? that uh, and then I need this there's really any point in using those things those are kind of like emergency ones also use this as it's available uh, these are taking damage like they have a durability on them the mousies mobs thing Because you're right, Teratus. They definitely you're right. They definitely did not take damage back in the day. What if this light beam mod causes lag? It might. It's not happy when I'm insta breaking stuff. Or not as happy, I guess. Those they are fun. Yeah, I agree. And their boss had some good drops, I remember. So like it was worth was worth killing more than just one. Okay. That should be enough sand for our purposes right now. So let's go let's just go focus on getting gravel so we can go back and start this stuff. Yeah, he does a lot of damage. We're not going to go there until diamond armor for sure. And maybe a bow. Uh, get nighttime. Still can't get over the infinity ham. Ah, uh, smell three. Gotta make grout. 
and drink water. Oh, it's so delicious. Thanks, I guess. Appreciate it. Thanks for watching, you know. Appreciate all the compliments. Hope you're having a good day. What's that? Something there. I think this is the one we already hit. Uh, no, it is a different one. A lot of gilded to be had there. I wonder if there is soul sand in the middle of this, though. Oh, no, this is the one we hit already. Hey, Amara first. How you doing today? Yeah, that makes sense, because we spawned near some gravel beaches. Which I feel like I'm not heading towards. We are. It's okay. Yeah, basically, that recording command is there just to so people know that... It's a llama bee. That's also a skeleton. A skeletal llama bee. Um, just so people know that, like, when we do, like, basically it's just gonna be doing intros and whatnot. Intros, maybe an outro. We're doing Tarkov or something. That's it. Other than that, we're gonna be streaming normally. I feel like I'm getting a large amount of gravel from this. Or flint from this, excuse me. What if that's a byproduct of the Matic? Possible. Hello. Sorry, we'll just do it this way then. I do have boosted luck from the thing we're wearing, which I don't know if luck affects fortune, though. I feel like it shouldn't, but it might. I thought luck was just fishing and looting. But it could be, I mean, it could be different from the mod, right? Could totally be it. I think, right? Yeah. Wonder how I wonder how heavily we'll have to dive into that. I'm okay with that though. In this pack, I'm very okay with that, I think. Be fun. Not that I don't like create, I like create, I just it's one of those mods where I have to be forced to use it, I think. Uh yeah, why don't we try taking that off? That might have been it. Nice. Great, it's good. It's less powerful than other mods, but it's good. It's fun. And unfortunately, my engineering, my stupid engineering brain only likes using the most powerful stuff that I have at the time. Well, not only. There are a few things and exceptions to that. But I struggle with that, you know? pretty good.
make heads or tails of it. It's fair. Yeah. But we need we need to we need some uh, extra to pour over onto um, the stuff to make the coke oven as well, which I want to get going immediately. Put this back on so I don't forget. And then let's get um let's get this going. That'd be kinda cool, Simon. That'd be really cool. That sounds like like invasion but skyblock mode. That'd be dope. Alright, so now we just gotta head towards uh, home here. Jerks. Okay, 45 degree angles, supposedly the best. Depends on where you are. I think if you're high up, you could do pretty fast left right. Oh, here we go. Here's our soul sand. There you go. That's exactly what we need. I was gonna grab it over here. So this is how we get that smeltery stuff done. True. I don't know. There's uh, there's definitely something intriguing about the idea of like floating islands. I've always loved those that generation for like Project Ozone and stuff. Really cool. Someone did that with the Aether Dimension. That's kind of neat. Yeah. I still like the idea of, like, a very minimalistic skyblock where it takes you hours of grind to get somewhere because you need, like, vanilla mechanic RNG to get there. You know, a very vanilla skyblock. I think they're so cool. Not too great. Yeah, so different meteors means this is how we get our nether stuff, I think. I, I like the idea of the meteors. I don't know. It changes up the landscape a bit. Pretty neat. I believe soul sand or soul soil can be used for this. This is also how we get... Um, I'm assuming we can find wither skeleton somewhere in the overworld. Because this is how we we have to defeat the defeat the wither before going to the nether. That's one of the gates. I know that. Oh, thanks. Did you actually grab that? I can't tell. Very cute. Yeah, both can be used in the crafting of whatever the thing is we need to craft, which is this nether grout. So magma cream is going to be the hard one to get, which I don't know if they've dropped any magma cream, but in the airship, there was definitely a spawner of skeletons that turned into magma creams when they died. That's a little bit of a spoiler because I knew about that, but like, and then slime's obviously easy to get, but like, as long as we get blazes as well or blaze rods as well somewhere, I don't know. Could be interesting. No need. I'm getting nuggets for mining this with something. Oh, there was a chest in the middle of these. Sneaky. I've got the moon sand. I wonder how useful. I wonder if moon sand's super useful. It might be actually. The reason we have this. Is 
so we can pick up random crap. There we go. Because that might be, like, necessary for progression. Especially if it's spawning in the overworld. We can actually grab the chest. That means the other, the other meteor probably has a chest in it, too. Uh, what was I looking at to get that recipe? It was this. Oh. Oh. Mm, wrong magma cream block. Does not look like it. Looks like you can also find them. Oh, maybe not there. Yeah, I think that's how we get it, is those. I think we were getting them. I can't remember. We were fighting that airship, and I don't remember whether, you know what we were getting there. These are gold nuggets, right? Yeah, I'm getting gold nuggets from that. Uh, I need to sleep. Oh, is that what it was? Gotcha. I don't know. It said something about that. Maybe the wither's not, not needed. Maybe the wither's needed for something else. I don't know. Either way, we'll figure it out. Oh, did the dolphin die? Whoops. Sure, chat will think it's my fault. Uh, put all that away if we can. To pick up that. Then we can put these up in here, I guess. Alright, I'm just trying to get back to my base. Well, I'm not just trying to get back to my base, but I like exploring. Uh, let's check out that house too on our way back. Oh, that was weird. But we have enough here. If we need to get more, we can always come poach a little bit more, or try to find a new meteor, to be honest. Looks like a... What are you? Skystone. So this is an actual A2 meteor, which apparently we can get into A2 only after the... Um... Yeah. I'm just going to leave that there. We, we can get into A2 after going to the moon, apparently. This is a roguelike dungeon entrance house, but I could be wrong. It's keeping up with the theme of spawning way too high up. Yeah, it is. Might as well eat some cake. Those are somewhat annoying to craft, so we'll grab that. There's also a chest. Yeah. We got potion of regen. Efficiency. This one had mending on it. Right, if we can rip off enchantments, man, we're good to go. Is that oh, sugar cane maybe red mushroom that nah, don't really need that all right cool. yeah so roguelike uh delicious Sixty version A two is buggy. Gotcha. Wrong window. Wait, what? Oh, oh, oh I, see. I see. Uh, I see. I think we maybe we didn't go to that house. That's fine, though. Let's just keep getting towards home. Nice. I don't want the tree. I just want the saplings. Or I don't want these, these that much. I just want the saplings here. And just one should be more than enough.
keep heading home, which we're due west now. Uh, goes faster. This is faster. Make gold apples for our tinker stuff. That'd be good. I see the bamboo. Oh, roof. just missed it. All right, nice. Uh, so funny enough, John, vanilla tools are so good nowadays and easy to get upgraded that I honestly think Tinker's tools have been are kind of worse. Different 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 grinds different progressions of course but like i've been not very impressed by the tinker's tools early game power level i'm sure they're better later but i just or maybe they're not who knows you can always just get rid of that mod joker honestly i'm not sure what mod those things are from but i could definitely see getting rid of that mod it doesn't feel necessary. It feels like it's for the Halloween event, you know? But that's just me. And I guess I didn't grab that much extra clay. But we have three stacks here. Hopefully we'll find more soon. Sure we will. I gotta stop placing torches there. It's gonna get annoying really fast. That'll make a nice little chunk there. We'll do this old school where we just get a bunch of different chests instead of hopper cart them everywhere or hopper them everywhere. I can still pick that up though, which is interesting. Um, hmm. Yeah, fine, I guess I'll put it in there. Yeah, so slow goes in there too, I guess. Let's get a diamond. Curse of Vanishing means basically nothing to us. So I guess we use this guy. Put all that away. Flint and Diamond. Redstone. I guess we don't get double here, right? So... that real quick i want to get the um i want to get this guy enchanted properly and potentially get more redstone on this guy oh we have this oops Ooh, which is more than enough one two we have no way to get sharpness on our sword just yet so this will be fine D question is does that add sharpness that one does add sharpness so if we find a way to convert this I wonder if um, a compacting drawer works on that. It's usually the way it goes. It might. Okay, that's all familiar to us. So like we could try to make a compacting drawer, you know? Hey, George. Good to, t good to have you here. Good, glad you could tune in. Thanks for hanging out with us. I always say it. One of my favorite parts about Twitch is being on a hangout people from all over the world. It's really cool. It usually works, which would be good because the airship that we found, uh, where did, where was that? 
There. This airship right here has a ton of quartz blocks in it. So we can get our sword sh really sharp. Like, r stupid sharp. I do like the, I do like Tetra as a as like a kind of a, like a replacement idea for Tinkers. I think this version of Tinkers would have been really sick in 112. I don't know how well it works in 116. And I'm not sure what's different. It's just a feeling. And I still don't I still don't mind it. Like I still like it. So I don't know. It's hard to say. I feel like this gives more than it's supposed to give um Trades an ability slot for two upgrade slots. Oh, I don't know what the... Gotcha. I'd rather have that anyway. I, I realize I'm not getting extra there. I don't know what the abilities are, but I guess there's different things you can add to your Tinker stuff. Early game, all I care about is that. Also, I just added that to the two... <laughs> I added those to the wrong thing. Ay -ay -ay. Classic dirt pine here. Ability slot. I think we have to look through the book. Hit you on the tool. Yeah. So what do these add on though? You know, like which... That's not abilities though. I don't think, because isn't um, Redstone in this? Yeah, so Haste is in this. Oh, also you can put Haste on a sword too, that's cool. Oh, it tells you which one. Does it? Requires one upgrade slot, I see. Is there a quick picture? Ah, I see. So the stars are ability slots. Which is stuff like dual wielding is kind of cool. Oh, that's kind of neat too. Definitely get two, two rapiers going. But there's also Icy. That's super cool. I like that. That is dope. Severing's good. Helps with helps with a lot of stuff. Padded. Reduces the knockback of the tool to stop your enemies from escaping. <gasps> it's what I've always wanted. Oh, that's what I've always wanted. Because if you want to get up in something's face and spam click on it, that's what you want. Also, I guess pierces deals damage which attacks through armor. Deals bonus damage which attacks through armor. That's pretty good too. Oh, okay. All right, I like tankers again. <laughs> I kid, I kid. Necrotic. We don't want knockback. Hmm, that's neat. Oh, that's cool too. Variant. Fiery. Nice. Gotcha. It's. A, I think it's more of one of those. Just try them out. I would say. That you know, that's probably where you're best off being at. Is just try them out, and we're gonna we're gonna try them out. Like we'll make a once we get to a, right, a nice place, we'll we'll definitely do that. You know, Did not mean to throw that. Didn't even know you could throw that. Kind of cool. Kind of weird. Y 
Yeah, do it, Iron Gajil. It's good. Uh, all right, we might as well get this going as well. But yeah, so for now, we want to trade the abilities for extra slots, which I like a lot, actually. All right, I want to get Diamond on that thing for sure. Beautiful. Uh, we're gonna put these masks. I think we're gonna put these masks up in here. That seems right to me. Did I not empty these? Oh, I didn't empty these. That's also something we can do. Oh, dang, the moon sand got away again. I forgot to get that out. We also had more of that there, classic. Uh, I mean, mending books are great. Books are great. Put that away. Put these away. To mine colony things. Uh, armor things. That. Out. Do the same thing again. We're gonna trick this into being into something else. That's gonna be this um this box here. Let's just speed up that process a little bit, I think. This is going to be the, uh, I can't hold this thing. Uh, we have plenty of extra chests here, so why don't we grab that. And we're going to make a nether chest. Yeah. So then we can put these these up in here that up in there that up in there this up in here nope that up in there nether stuff nice or this i gotta get these sacks out of my inventory uh let's just keep them in our backpack i guess they're kind of a free way to get up uh extra extra room there Leave those in there. Uh, I think I'm going to put the books over here. That just makes sense. And then these guys over here. Can you make time in, bo time in a bottle? Probably. Right? Isn't that a uh, Project D thing? Sure. Uh, keep the hopper in a backpack. That turned out to be very useful to have there. That goes in there. It's got two of these. What can I do with these besides the normal vanilla stuff? Oh, that's a really good one. Th this ring is awesome. I can just craft a trident too. That's pretty dope. That actually might be a pretty sick uh, range weapon for us. Shield of the Deep. Nice. So if I can get myself a Prismarine shard here. that i do play hardcore i don't know if it's op i get the feeling you think everything's op though john so that's okay <laughs> uh where'd i put my infinite ham that's a question i never thought i'd ask i 
Anybody see my infinite ham? Shouldn't be in any of those. I finished it. I hope not. I did say infinite ham, yes. Did I drop that somewhere and just not pick it up? That's entirely possible. It's not the biggest loss in the world. It's OP and vanilla. Sure, it's OP and vanilla, yeah. I have no idea where my infinite ham is. I must have dropped this somewhere by accident. <laughs> oh, well. It can't be in these because they're stacked. Oh, they are growing. Nice. Does the JEI search focus thing work in this? Uh, I'm not sure what you mean by search focus. Double checking for the ham here. I definitely had to have dropped it somewhere random. Whoops. Oh, uh, probably. Maybe not. Just realized that the search bar is over here, not here. That's kind of funky. It's not letting me double click. Maybe there's a setting that you have to re enable. I personally don't like that, so I'm going to leave it disabled and I don't mess with that. I don't think I can craft iron armor. Yeah, you can't craft iron armor just yet. That said, I can go barter for it, which is what we're gonna be working towards now. Um, I'm gonna miss having that hat, man. That hat was so good. Uh, but I guess I want to get the smeltery going first, though. I want to get the smeltery going first. Uh, we need to make a campfire. So we can complete all these tasks. Um, so that we can... Yeah, keep those going. Sorry, lose my train of thought again. Uh, not without silk touch username, no. Sticks that, that, that. Piece of cobblestone. Vertical campfire? That's not how campfires work. <laughs> That's not how that works. Oh yeah, yeah. All right, we have we have space now. We can afford to grab all this crap just so they're finished. I hate I hate having like unfinished tasks there. That's just not how that works. It probably is good for damaging mobs, honestly, to push them into it, but like still. I like the accurate fire physics. I'm glad you do. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you do. All right, any glass? Well, that gives us a little sand. Come on, punishing me for smelting my grout early. Oh, are we actually one short? Look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this. Oh man, that's really funny. Good thing I have a, a little bit of extra clay here, but that's so funny. Wow. Punished, punished for being prepared. Yes, yeah, so we gotta make all these things up. Is it nighttime again already? Didn't I just sleep? I feel like I just slept. 
Guess time flies when you're having fun, huh? Piss off. Get off my kid. Get, get off my kid. Get off my lawn, you damn kids. I got that backwards in my head. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I know, I know. If you start thinking about, like, Minecraft physics, it just doesn't work. Get off my kids, you damn bond. Uh, classic dead pine. Classic dead pine. All right, let's make this a quick little tinkers thing, I guess. Put those in there. Too silly. Far too silly. All right. Uh, yeah, I guess we need to make... I have a bunch of these saved from last time. Right. We just need to get that to the point where I can make copper. We're going to need that. We're going to need that and that. craft that all right I guess I need a little bit more glass here so why don't we get that going I'm gonna want glass in general anyway just for day-to-day -day use it's gonna save a book your shield beat you to it yeah yeah All right, uh, we have lava downstairs, I think. Is there any lava pits? This is the closest lava pit overworld, or maybe this one? They're pretty close. Uh, we could just, we really can't just use downstairs. Is there any tanks we can make right now? Just these guys, okay. I wanna make a few of them. I wanna fill up a few of these, I think. Or at least one. Seared ingot tank, holding 32 ingots of fluid, retaining liquid when broken. Thirty-two ingots of fluid, sorry. That's yep, okay, that's not what I want. That's that I read that wrong. Um This uses more seared brick, but it lets us store more because it uses less glass. So I think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm gonna do that. I wanna I don't wanna waste all my iron on a bucket. So let's do that. These will hold four piece. So Twenty buckets there to work with. Excellent. Oh, and they stack too. Nice. All right, beautiful. apparatus all right Let's just start gathering it all into there i guess well i guess i need these out and i need copper do i have copper two copper so i need to go mining for copper as well so we need to um get to a smaller area or a low sorry a higher area in the mine and that will get us going new world uh, mostly for YouTube but we also did die once in the restarts but 
That's okay. Let's, let's go to 40. Oh, which is kind of where this was. Let's just go to let's just go to where this was. This is a nice starting area. 38. That's fine. Should have some copper here, I think. Might be a little bit too low. I can't believe I lost my infinite ham. There we go. But yeah, I, I wanted to record this for YouTube Insight, and um, the music we were playing during the other sessions were just, it just, what didn't even let me release it, let alone monetize it. I believe you need four total. This kind of building sounds neat. All right, let's start taking this down. This is what we're gonna put the smelter in this corner here. This is just our starter base. Like I'm gonna use this until we run out of room, and then we're gonna build like a nicer big base. Uh, honestly, probably out of Deep Slate because I really like Deep Slate and I, I want to build with it. So Deep Slate plus something basically is where we're at here. So not one for using a small space like this usually, but I think this will be fine. Walls of this. Excellent. Some of the particle effects there, I guess. Um, all right. Now we have this. Uh, we do want glass because I do want to make this stuff. For the front bit there. We're on a double workout. I think we're on a double workout from that. Makes sense. Yeah, set a few of those aside. 64 should be enough to build with, though. And then we have these as well. We're going to make a drain here, too. Right, Joker. We, we I thought it was going to double, so we built a large one last time. And then now we know that it doesn't double. We don't need a large smelter. We just need one to like make Tinker's tools. Maybe. And it doesn't even alloy, I don't think. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This sword's terrible. Don't use it. It's horrible. Uh, devs, if you're watching, it's really, it's it's the worst ever. I just use it because it's a, it's a pet. It's a pet, you know. I really enjoy it, you know. It has nothing to do with it's how good it is at all. But yeah, it's real bad. So a little 3x5 here should be excellent. Uh, okay. Yeah, most expert packs, most expert packs make ore doubling a bit hard, or make the requirements for ores just out of this world ridiculous. For sure. All right, since we don't double there, I guess we just cook the copper up, right? Oh, you can choose. 
Oh, that's cool. Huh. That's neat. I like that. Alright, uh, just a few more of these. We don't need that many. Um... I mean, that's what I want to make the drains out of, but we're going to need a bit more than that, copper-wise, to make more drains. So we'll just do it. We'll work with the two for now. Excellent. We'll get two of these going. Eventually a third. Um, yeah, eventually a third for that. And that's, like, way more than we really need. But. That'll be fine. And then I do want to... Might as well do this one, because it's... Standalone there. Uh, grab you. We'll just do three for now. We'll get the third one in there later. Sleep it up. True, even if it's not doubling, it is faster, especially after a long mining trip. But like, this is still plenty big. And it's super automatable, right? So it's like, that's fine. All right, excellent. Probably, probably forgot something here, but that's okay. Right, that's where we, that's where we want to get going ASAP. Um, that's just how you can use more than solids. Molten obsidian, don't cry. I guess that's for these guys. I'm guessing that's just required for the blast furnace bricks. Got it. And scorched stone is this junk, which is that junk. It is a public pack. Yep. And it is, if you enjoy expert packs, I would highly recommend. Okay. I need more clay is what I need. Because I want to make some more grout here. We have this saved up because we're smart like that. Also, I really like this recipe for crafting these. Uh, where's that closest clay at? Might be, that might be clay. Hard to tell. If not in the river here, for sure. Let's get our stuff away so we can work with this. Got to grab some levers there, too. Yep. Oh, uh, yeah, that's a building thing. that there, I guess. Oh, we have the other hopper there, too, if we need it. Um, all right. Neat. So we don't really even need that much. I just need, like, a stack or two of grout. some food there too I don't know 
that was really worth it. This should probably be enough, though. These last three. Yeah, you don't insta die from water breathing, looks like. Hello, bear. No, thank God, thank goodness, Delta. Really don't like that mod. Yeah, you have to invest into good tools and stuff, you know. Probably don't need this much, but. Oh, I guess we could have added Pine Sass as a, um, I didn't even think about that, Georgi, as a sub emote, just so everybody can see it. Like, we'd leave it there, but I've not made a Scarecrow yet, no. No Pumpkin yet, though. Hey, get off my crap. <laughs> could you imagine if that's how a farmer took care of, like, the animals? Just came out with, like, a fancy, like, dueling rapier and just murdered things. <laughs> oh, that's right. I forgot it was in the pack as an enchantment. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. That would be really funny. Sounds like something my grandpa would do. It's, it's exactly like that, that Delta Plev. Yeah, I, for, I totally forgot about the enchantment plus the upgrade that you can do. Yeah. I was one of the weaker ones, Carlos. Like, you guys could poke fun at me for killing mobs in Minecraft that you're supposed to kill all the live long day, but that was one of the weaker ones. That crow should know better than to touch my crops. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Uh, actually, maybe not because I think this is this is casted by. Um, I think this is blood over bone. Yeah. So I don't think you can re-smelt it. We could try. I don't think you can though. Unless it turns into blood, which would be useful. Now, good, good, uh, good idea though. Uh, MC fan, good idea. I like that outside of the box thinking there. Skip some progression or get some benefits, you know? No, who killed Pokemon? It's rude. They faint. Come on. Could you imagine if there was a game where there was like full on, like just gory Pokemon fights? I feel like you would you'd piss off a generation. But That'd be pretty wild. All right. Lever, hopper. Uh, yeah. Let's go. Sticks. The Pokemon Mongo is pretty wild. I believe it. What have a chest of beds? Uh, for, for a village. We're going to make a big old village later. And village breeder. I don't know about the breeder part, but I definitely need to get to diamond armor for sure. You know? I'm just gonna put this in here now so I don't forget about it later. That's not how levers are crafted. So you can automate this very nicely with this. Simple Obsidian Small Blade is pretty, is a better part for the rapier. It has a fancy name, something Obsidian. Has base three damage. Oh, that's nice. Mm, yeah, so we got to do Molten Obsidian, right? That's the one. Oh, that's Cobalt, though. Oh, it goes over wood. I see. Oh, it has Lacerating, too. That's kind of cool. It's like a supportive thing. 
Yeah, base 3 damage is quite powerful. Nice. Not anymore, I don't think. The question is, can I dump obsidian here? Do I have to put, put lava in? And I think that smells. It looks like it's smelting it. Nice. I wonder what the uh, durability of that is like. Just adds a lot of attack damage. The Rose Gold was pretty good too for attack speed as well. So like a, a combination of these two plus Rose Gold would probably be pretty good. the kitchen i'm not gonna read that one out loud that's that's a horrible pun and by horrible i mean it's really good because it is horrible but you you, you know what i meant it's brittle but it's also um sharp you can you can uh chip it away to make it sharp it's called napping not the kind where you, you know, you're tired after lunch and you take a nap, but the kind where you craft a knife from stone or glass or obsidian by chipping away with a blunt object. All right, how much gold do we have? I want to make basically all of the casts. I like the idea of sand casts. We're not going to be using them, though. Yeah, Terra Firmacraft had napping. Yep. Right, like an arrowhead. But you're but you're right, it is very brittle. Very, very brittle. I might speed this up. Do we have enough seared brick here? I guess I used it all in that. Oh no, we do, okay. So I guess we used it all in that, but. up a little bit uh, let's make some stone parts here uh, also a yeah casting chest at some point I want to make we're gonna make one of each there's just no reason to not we gotta go mining for more copper as well this they do take a second to form there's that video uh, that exploded over a year can you cast an obsidian into a blade was that um Alex? Is that his name? Popular blacksmithing YouTube channel. They're not called Obsidian. You have to run Obsidian over wood. It seems like that's kind of the new... Alex Steel, thank you, yeah. That seems like the new way to do stuff is like you kind of almost coat a prior material with another material. It's got a lot of things like that. Yeah, it's true. Ah, uh, it's the kitchen, which is pretty cool. Honestly, it's a really cool idea. All right, that's doing that now. So we'll let that finish up, but let's go do this. Let's get rid of you, put you back. Also, let's get that going, because that finishes up a task as well. We're going to put this right here. The cool thing is this one gives you a, a hammer. Let's get that started. This is, oops, this is where we get all of our creosote oil from, is this thing. Progression is definitely happening here. It's nice. I just want to get it. Was not expecting to be able to rotate that so easily. Uh, that was a little wild. Okay. 
put all that away. I want to get these parts going here. I also want to make a casting or a cast chest, which we should have enough for. I just need to get a blank cast. So we'll do that. It's so funny not having another piece of copper here to do with that. Oh, these guys, right. These guys don't... Um, I think I have enough to make this. Sure do. Oh, I need to get the ingot cast going as well. satisfying having a full set of casts for whatever you need excellent we're gonna have to want to get more individuals of those as well in fact let's just get three total of those because we know we're gonna want it yeah gab good it would that would, that would be a really good decorative block. Agreed. Or could be a really good decorative block. Depending on how used. Alright. So obsidian over wood is what we're looking to do here. So let's just get that. I just want to see what the sword panda looks like here. And it has good durability as well. Might be worth. Might be worth. I didn't mean to make this one. Leave that in there. I still want to get Rose Gold onto there because it increases the attack speed as well. Pretty good. Oh, yeah, okay, that's bad. But this, this is really good. Nice. Actually, it decreases the attack. I guess because of the... It's got a 1.3x attack damage multiplier, though. Maybe because it's just that... That's weird. Shouldn't that be positive? Oh, it is positive. It's the speed that goes down. I see. Ah, because of the 0.9. Right. Okay. Yeah, no, I think I'd rather have that. Because that brings it up to 6. Right. I don't know why I'm thinking about that. Um, that doesn't really do much else there. Okay. Uh, what if I could re-smelt that? Sure can. Nice. Um... And we replace the other two parts with rose gold. That bumps up the attack speed. This is going to be absurd. Nice. All right. Uh, chat, I got to grab a quick break here. YouTube, that's going to do it for this episode. We're going to mess with more Tinker stuff. We're going to go... Uh, I need to get pig iron in here. So I need to get an animal into there somehow. Uh, get blood so I can get... Um, a pig a backpack going. So I can move the villagers around and make a really nice uh, villager farm. That's going to be... Some, something next time, next few episodes. But YouTube, thanks for tuning in. Make sure to join the Twitch stream. Catch you next one.